that's where I felt at home. Create a production order. What are the different way? First is MD04. What is in MD04? You can simply go to the uh, your plan order. Okay, now this is my plan order. We can click on the plan order. And once you click on the plan order, there is option to convert the plan order to production order. So we'll click on this production order. Okay. Oh, this is lock. I open it somewhere else. Let me close this. Huh? It was already open somewhere. Let me go back to MD04. Okay, now in MD04. Okay, this is my plan order. I will double click on this and I will click on production order. And the system will take me directly to the creation of production order screen. And then I will just release it and save it. And my production order will get created. Now here this plan order line will get replaced with the production order number. Now you can double click and display the production order. So, by using MD04 T code, we can create a production order. Are we clear, everyone? MD04? Yes or no? Yes, yes. Okay. Now, second option is manually, that is CO01. Now, what is the CO01 T code? It's very easy slash and CO01. And you can provide the material number, production plan, and order type PP01. What is order type? We will learn later. Okay. Now, this is a material type, material and production order plan and order type. Only three input. And you can press enter button. And they will ask you how much quantity you have to manufacture. I said 10 quantity. When you have to end it, I will say it has to be get end by this. Okay. Then you press enter button. And system will give you the start date automatically. And you will have all these details. And then you can release and save this. But can you see it? This is totally manual intervention. How much quantity need to be manufactured? When it has to start? There is nothing is having any calculated thing. Okay. Here, in case of your MD04, MD04 is what? In MD04, you have this plan order. Now, plan order coming from where? Your plan, right? This is your LSF requirement, okay? In MD63 or MD61, MD62, you updated this plan. This month I want this quantity, this month this quantity. And from this plan, you are coming to LSF and this LSF 137 quantity is converted into the plan order. And this plan order, you are converting into the production order, right? So this is very standard and systematic approach. Because MRP doing the calculation, MRP doing the date definition, everything is done by the MRP and then this plan order is created. Perfect. This is output of your MRP. Now, here what is happening? You are doing it manually. Calculation of quantity, how much quantity? 10. It might be 100 by mistakely, somebody put like that. I suppose they want to create 1000 quantity and they will type extra zero. Will it happen or not by manual mistake? Yes or no? Team. Okay, so this can be happen in this way because people might create extra quantity of material. So in order to avoid this transaction CO01 is not given to any production user or it will be given to very specific or very genuine super user who is very much sure that he will not use this transaction. We will not create any order, any order in the system with this T code CO01. Why? Because there is no control. It's totally manual. But why then it is given a provision? Now imagine today is the end of the month, okay? Or suppose there is something in emergency need to be manufactured. And for that manufacturing, 
we don't have any one available from planning team who can change the md61 who can take mrp run who can create a plan order and who can give us the production order nobody is available and now it is emergency and there is a requirement from client that uh, sales team that they require 10 quantity of extra material so in that case very precisely somebody will go and create this production order okay it is the emergency situation tool it is not a daily usable thing okay are you clear co01 t code you should not use very rank, uh, abruptly okay are you clear you should always go and use it only when it is very much required else you are not supposed to use this okay are you clear team so yes. co01 t code authorization will not given to any user it is a emergency tool only use in emergency okay now mm -hmm.